Is sabbatical leave considered as continuous service for gratuity? This query is as intriguing as it is important. The answer to this lies in understanding the legislative provisions and court cases that have set a precedent. Diving into the legislative provision, we'll look at Section 2A.1 of the Payment of Gratuity Act of 1972. It states that an employee is said to be in continuous service for a period if they've been in uninterrupted service. This includes service that may be interrupted due to sickness, accident, leave, absence from duty without leave, layoff, strike, or a lockout, or cessation of work not due to any fault of the employee. Whether such service was rendered before or after the commencement of the act is immaterial. Now, what does this mean for an employee on sabbatical leave? Does it count as continuous service? For more clarity, we turn to the court cases. The Supreme Court of India, in the case of Jeevan Lal, 1929, Limited, and Oz versus Appellate Authority under the Payment of Gratuity Act, and Oz has provided some insight. Similarly, the Madras High Court in the case of H. Ramapa S. O. Hanumanthapa and Oz versus the General Manager, Sri Yalama Cotton Woolen and Silk Mills and Oz, has also shed light on this issue. The crux of these rulings is that if an employee is absent from duty due to sabbatical leave and it was permitted by the employer, they are entitled to the benefit of gratuity. However, this is unless the employer has passed an order treating such absence without leave as a break in service in accordance with the standing orders of employment applicable to the employee. In essence, sabbatical leave, when permitted by the employer, is considered as part of continuous service for the purpose of gratuity, unless explicitly stated otherwise by the employer. Today, we've unraveled a complex issue, making it simple and easy to understand. We've dissected the legislative provision and court cases to answer our initial question. Sabbatical leave is indeed considered as continuous service for gratuity, provided it's permitted by the employer and not treated as a break in service. The law is clear and as always, it strives for fairness and justice.